Joe. This is the Joe is Hungry channel. I'm at Arby's in Calhoun, Georgia, and today I'm gonna check out their new King's Hawaiian Fish Deluxe Sandwich. Thank you for choosing Arby's order when you're ready, please. Okay, can I get two King Hawaiian Fish Deluxe Sandwiches? No drink, no fries. Okay, that total is going to be $9.82 at the window. Well, I've got my King Deluxe Fish. Let's pull around to the back and do the Joe is Hungry temperature test. Yeah. What kind of pictures you take? Uh, doing a YouTube video food review. Here, let me do this real quick. YouTube food review. Yeah, I show you in a minute. I, these things are cooling off. I got to get them while they're hot. These things come in at a blistering 160.6 degrees Fahrenheit. We can rest assured that these were definitely fresh and definitely cooked to order. So they passed the Joe is Hungry heat test. So for further evaluation, let's head back to the studios of Joe is Hungry located in the dog sanctuary and backwater town of Fairmount, Georgia. Today I'm reviewing the Arby's limited time offer King's Hawaiian Fish Deluxe Sandwich. This thing has the same fish patty that the crispy fish sandwich does that you can get on the two for six dollar menu uh, except it has uh, different bread and more ingredients it has tartar sauce iceberg lettuce tomatoes cheddar cheese crispy fish filet all on a king's hawaiian bun by itself it'll set you back three dollars and 59 cents and as a meal it'll set you back five dollars and 99 cents and it is not available on the two for six menu arby's has a posted serving weight of 301 grams which equals 10.5 ounces i also got two of them so i can check for consistency between hawaiian king and hawaiian king fish sandwich i've taken off for the packaging that the sandwich comes in in other words i've set the tear on my scales Fish sandwich number one comes in at 9.25 ounces. Fish sandwich number two comes in at 9.35 ounces. It falls below their own posted serving weight by at least an ounce, but they do pass the Joe is Hungry consistency test in weight because they are pretty close. So I'll have to give them a big fail on the Joe is Hungry weight test, which leads me on to the next step, which is the Joe is Hungry big reveal. This is what it looks like, and this is what it's supposed to look like. This is what it looks like, and this is what it's supposed to look like. We've seen what it looks like. We've seen how much it costs. We've even seen that it's kind of short-weighted. So that only leaves one last thing, and that is the Joe is Hungry bite test. Bite test engage. Definitely a wet, sloppy sandwich. The bread is a little sweeter than their sesame seed bun. The bread also tends to get soggier a little bit faster. 
Uh, kind of don't like that either. Um, the cheese they put on it kind of helps the flavor out. I can taste the cheese. Uh, the uh, tomatoes they put on it, they're okay too, but I don't really think they add a whole lot to the sandwich. And of course there's lettuce. I just don't like a sandwich to be slipping out of my hands and slipping out of the bread and dissolve before I can get it all eaten. As far as the value, for $3.59, I mean it's not bad, it's only a 50 cent more than what you'd pay for the uh, two for six special on the uh, smaller version of this. So I really can't complain about the value, so it's kind of middle of the road on that. I'm really not sure that that Hawaiian bread really adds anything to the sandwich. And of course the Pollock's good. And the breading's not crispy anymore because it, all the wetness in here uh, gets all soaked up by it. Um, the fish is flaky. Oh. So it's time to give this thing a score, I guess. Um, Y'all know my score. My score is 1 to 10. By and being the best, anything above 9 is a once in a lifetime experience. 8 to 9 is traveling food. It is on the screen and in the description below. So let's go ahead and give this bad boy a number and call it a day. I'm going to have to go with a um, 6 8. Um, if it wasn't so wet and maybe they did something about the bread soaking everything up, it's just a wet sandwich. Um, felt like it could have been a little bit better. Um, that's my review. Um, if you found this interesting, subscribe to the channel, support the channel. I need subscriptions, of course. And we will see you in the next video. Hey.